So for part A, we're trying to find the angular velocity of the second hand. And so we can say that the angular velocity of the second hand moves through one revolution through 60 seconds. And this is giving us 0 0.105 radians per second. For B, the minute hand, the minute hand um, essentially goes through two pi radians during one hour, or we can say 3,600 seconds. So this is giving an angular velocity of 1.75 times 10 to the negative third radians per second. For the uh, hour hand, for the hour hand, we have, of course, uh, 12 hours in the AM, 12 hours in the PM. So here uh, it's moving through one revolution every half day. We can say 12 hours. And then we can multiply one hour for every 3,600 seconds. And we find that the angular velocity of the hour hand would be 1.45. Times 10 to the negative fourth radians per second. That is the end of the solution. Thank you for watching.